day 708 and I just finished my run and I have a story to tell. <laughs> I was just over at my usual running spot by the canal, the, the zoo, and just trudging through it. I mean, today was <clears throat> kind of getting those final kinks out from the half marathon on Sunday. And I got, let's see, one mile to somewhere around two and a half miles. So two and a half miles in, and I'm looking at these two runners come by, and I'm like, they got really clean form, and they look really relaxed. And then they get right about, I don't know, like five feet in front of me, but maybe 10 feet apart, if that makes sense. So diagonally in front and I just stopped running and I'm just looking and I'm like I think I know who this is and it takes a second to register because <coughs> I didn't think that they would be here running and I was like are you Emma Coburn and then she kind of like smiles and turns like yeah and I was like shut the front door <laughs> And I think she, I said it like kind of loud and I was still, I'm stunned, I'm shocked. I was like, normally I run here and I, I just see people on bikes and walking their dogs. I don't see hardly any runners, let alone a pro for New Balance. And she kind of laughs after I say, shut the front door. And she laughs, just like, hi. And I was like, hi. I don't even know if I said anything. I, I In my head, I'm just like, holy cow, like. I don't know, I just, they kept running their way, I kept running my way, and then I, I had my turnaround, came back, and they were on the other side of the canal, and I just kind of waved. I don't, I think they were in their own conversation. But, holy freaking cow, like, shut the front door. <laughs> but anyways, I mean, Emmett Coburn has been a pro for I don't know how many years. She's has, she's been an Olympian, or three-time Olympian, bronze medalist in steeplechase, silver medalist in world championship, and an actual world champion in a steeplechase. And her best time in the steeple was like a 9.02 leads for the steeple. She's one of the top female steeplechasers. And holy cow, just incredible just to see the run. <laughs> I guess I'm just shocked, like the things you see on a run Right? Normally it's dogs and walkers and all that. And then you see a pro athlete and you recognize them and just say hi. And they just, they just sounded really nice from just the two words they said, right? But yeah, made the run new and exciting, I guess. And then to continue my run, just got back, did a few drills and strides. Got to get back to go walk the pup. And then gonna go do a taco night. Got invited to go do a taco, chicken taco night. And the chicken's marinated. So it's supposed to be really, really good. And so I'm gonna go walk the dog, take a nice warm shower because I'm cold. It's getting cold again. Even though the sun was out, it was still a little bit chilly. It was like a light breeze. And yeah, I'm gonna eat a little bit, have the pup play around, and then and then, and then, and then, we should call it a night. Try to get some sleep. I, I don't feel rested. I, today I just feel a little tired. But kind of funny story. I don't know why. Maybe I'm more shocked about seeing, saying hi to Emma Coburn. And so I was on my way back. The canal was the last maybe mile, mile and a half. And there was, I'm passing people on the left and they're on the right. I tried to just not to say avoid people, but give them enough space. Because some people have the earplugs in or the headphones and zone out. And I hate scaring people and I hate people scaring me. <clears throat> and so I was on the far left, they were on the far right. And I pass them. And then someone just goes, hey, nice form. And, I, like, and in my head I'm thinking they're probably seeing the pro runner over here, Emma Coburn. And I'm looking around. I was like, I'm the only one running right here that I can see. So I turn around, and they were a little bit ways behind me, 
and they just smile and just kind of like they did like a running form i said hi just kind of a little wave i said oh hey thanks and then i just kept running but i mean nice to hear and i got on the other side of the canal and i i guess because i'm we're going towards each other just on opposite sides and they wave and say hey have a good one oh hey have a nice day and they do the running form thing again and they just keep smiling and waving and i'm just like ah okay have a nice day <laughs> Which is a nice thought. I mean, you don't hear that every day that you have a nice form, especially if your legs are tired and recovering from a long race. But I guess two takeaways from it, saying hi to a pro athlete and feeling like you have a form, like, I don't say like a pro athlete, but that you have a nice enough form to be complimented. How's that? I think that's fair enough. But that's the day in a quick nutshell I'm going to head out. Still in shock. And I just text my other buddy, and he's like, no freaking way. <laughs> oh, how cool. How cool. What, what a delight to see that on a run, just to see another pro, to see a pro athlete. And for them to be nice, even twice as great. So, that's the day. <laughs> so, run your life with health and happiness, and have a great night.